Hello and welcome to Sir Excel's KPI Dashboard Excel Template. In this video, we will be seeing what to achieve with this template and also how to operate. Basically, by entering your metrics and properties and also the metric properties and values in this section, you can get your cumulative results and also monthly comparison and also an analysis based on metrics. So, how to operate this template? Write your group names into these sections. These sections will be later on shown in these sections. It will be easier to diversify your metrics under each title. Later on, Write your KPI metric. You can choose your unit from the drop down list. The cumulative form is the number property of the metric. If it is number, you can choose number, and if it is something like a percentage or ratio, you can choose ratio. Choose if it is lower better and then choose your dashboard format. The dashboard format that you're going to choose in this section will affect these areas format. You can also take notes for each metric as well. Once you're done entering with your metrics, now you can input the values. For this example, let's assume that the numbers are the same with the customer acquisition cost. You can set the starting date in here and also choose the month from the drop down list as well. Once you're done with your actual database scores, now you can go to the second level database. You can use this section as a target database or past year's values to compare with your current year database. So enter your values. Once you enter your values for each metric, now the template is ready to make the comparison. You can go to cumulative actual board to see the cumulative results month by month for each metric and also for the target cumulative board as well. You can also check the KPI dashboard section to check your results monthly. You can set your index level co color intervals from this section. While below 80% is shown with red, between 80% and 100% is shown with yellow. If you want to change that, you can basically write 50 to 75, which now between 50% and 70% will be shown with yellow and below 50% is going to be red and above 75% is going to be green. You can also choose the highlight method if it is going to be according to monthly index, cumulative index, or also according to both. You can also make metric analysis in this section. All you have to do is choose the proper metric and later on the charts, the formulas, and also the index rate will be changed according to the chosen metric. I hope the video was informative and explanatory. Thanks for watching.